How many times in a month you drink alcohol? Is it every month or once in a week or every day? How long does it take for you to recover from that alcohol? Are you recovered immediately in two hours or are you recovered like me after three days? If you are following my YouTube channel, maybe you know that before doing this dry February challenge, I was doing a challenge drinking alcohol every day and I got six kilos while doing that challenge. So if you really want to get fatty without doing anything, then Drinking alcohol is a, <laughs> is an option. Hi, my name is Jovi Teopara Samuel. I'm a certified fitness coach. And last month I did a challenge and it's called the dry February challenge. So what is dry February means? It means no to alcohol for 30 days. So the entire February say no to alcohol. So I did that challenge and uh, in today's video, I'm going to explain to you what I found out while doing this challenge. People are asking me, is it very difficult to follow this challenge? To be frank, it was not that difficult. I just completed the challenge and I was thinking that maybe I am going to go very crazy with alcohol after 30 days of not touching that alcohol. This is what I have found out about myself. I thought I will be very crazy with alcohol. I'll be craving for alcohol, but that's not true. Second thing is how difficult it was to say no to alcohol. So normally I used to drink alcohol after meeting my friends, especially after game time. We normally sit there and we chat and we drink some beer normally. But during the last month, I said to my friends, I cannot <laughs> drink alcohol. So you guys can continue with your alcohol. They said, okay, if you're not drinking. So they supported me. I also tested my alcohol temptation going to a party. Normally when I go to a party, I used to drink alcohol. I used to say yes to all those occasions, but I went this time I decided that I'm not going to drink. I'm not going to touch. And I thought it will be very difficult, but it's not difficult. My friends were again supportive. They were not forcing that much. They said, okay, I understand you are doing a challenge. I respect your challenge, I respect your decision, so it's fine. So they were drinking, I was not drinking. Before doing this dry February challenge, I was doing a challenge, drinking alcohol every day. <laughs> and I got six kilos of body fat. I'm not talking about weight, I'm talking about the body fat. I normally do checkups every time when I do this kind of challenge to see what is my fat percentage, muscle percentage, water percentage, all these kind of things. And I found out that I was gaining six kilos of body fat just by drinking two beers every day. There are a couple of things I understood. One is my mental capacity is really increased. I'm not really crazy about alcohol. I'm not saying that I'm completely saying no to alcohol, no. But I can survive without alcohol. It takes me hours to recover from that alcohol. And if I'm drinking two, three, four beers, then it takes almost three days for me to recover, completely recover from that alcohol. And you know that when I am not completely recovered, my brain is not really working properly. And I, so my work is affected and the business what I am doing is affected. This is not what I, I want to spend my time with. Don't want to waste my time just drinking alcohol and wasting my hours. Or life, I don't know if you believe in, in any release. You know that God given this time to not to just waste. You have options to waste, you have option to use it properly. So I decided that I don't want to waste my time. The time which I have, I don't want to just drink alcohol and waste. So this is a decision I made and this is what I have learned. If you drink alcohol or if you don't drink alcohol, what is your experience with alcohol? Do you really like drinking alcohol? Well, there are a lot of studies about alcohol is not good. One shot is okay, but one and above is not okay. But problem with the one shot is that one shot <laughs> is in your control. But after the one shot, it's not in your control. Alcohol is taking control. That's why human being, we don't have that much power if you really think. There are a lot of people, strong people, I would say, <laughs> but they are crazy with. When it comes to alcohol, when it comes to saying no to alcohol, they cannot. This is another reason I decided to, I don't want cigarette or alcohol to take control of my life. And that's why I do this kind of challenge to make sure that, you know, I'm just making a balance. I strongly recommend you do a challenge. There are a lot of people thinking that I cannot do this challenge. I was also saying the similar thing, but unless you try this challenge, you never know what you are capable of. So I did almost, this is the 26th challenge I am doing it. And this is the first challenge I'm doing in 2024. When I did my first challenge, I was saying, no, I cannot do it. And I did it. I understand that I'm able to do challenges. So if you never did a challenge in your life and you are thinking that maybe you're not that strong, you cannot do it, I strongly recommend you do a challenge because your body, your mind is very stronger than what you think.